All right, thank you. And you heard Brian say it. It could be a while before we see some snow that actually sticks to the ground. And that's not good news for businesses that depend on it. NBC 15's Meredith Barrick went over to Tyrol Basin to see how the lack of snow is impacting them. There's n not snow anywhere else. Like, it doesn't seem like there should be snow out here. So it's. It's one of the few places in south central Wisconsin that you can actually find snow. It's hard for people to get in the spirit to come out and go skiing if they don't have any in their backyards. Tyrol Basin's general manager, Don McKay, says a year ago they had some of the best snow they'd seen in a long time. Uh, this year, you know, we've had some pretty good snow uh, given the uh, warmer temperatures, but uh, anytime you get over 40 degrees, it begins to be a problem with folks uh, getting in the mood to come out skiing. So much so, people don't even think they are open. Yesterday, the phone is ringing and people are saying, are you open? And well, how can you be open and how can you have any snow is raining out? But with the sun shining today, there was no shortage of those seeking out the slopes. Here you get out here, it's a winter wonderland. It's a whole lot of fun. And these skiers and snowboarders certainly appreciate it. They're definitely working their butts off out here, just trying to get snow on the hill for people to enjoy. Don says the snowmakers will do the work now. Well, he'll continue to wait on Mother Nature. Psychologically, snow is free advertising for us. It gets people in the road and gets them out here. Still going to take some actual snow to get people out in, in the really numbers that we'd hope and expect to see this time of year. At Tyrol Basin, I'm Meredith Barrick for NBC 15. I get this. The general manager says in order to not use their snowmakers, they'd need 40 inches of natural snow to fall.